Hello and welcome to your first ASMR personal session. Today we're going to see which triggers are the best for you and I will be helping you to find where your ASMR is. ASMR stands for Autonomous Meridian uh, Autonomous Sensory Meridian Response and you, it's basically when you get the tingles um, in some part of your body For me personally, I get it from the top of my head to just where my neck is about to start. Um, sometimes I also get it on the side of my back. I know some people who get it um, in their legs and in their spine. So it really depends on the person. I have a few here that is going that are going to help me um, during this personalized session. So first thing I'm going to start off with whispering. Now whispering is the most common type of ASMR trigger um, before ASMR community. Many people called this community the whispering community. So I'm going to get up close.
hopefully you've um, found that whispering helps you relax. If whispering doesn't trigger your ASMR, maybe something like personal attention can help trigger ASMR sounds for you. ASMR for you. Um, there have been a lot of videos if you go on to ASMR communities that um, like role plays, the reason why they're so popular is because of the personal attention that the viewer gets in the video. So in this video I'm going to just quickly show you some of the personal attention that someone could So for example, I'm going to just check your face and I'm going to look for any stress or just any kind of tiredness around your eyes. These type of personal touches personal attention can really bring reduced tingles. So since I'm giving you personal attention, I'm going to give you a nice temple massage. And I'm going to do this by rubbing my two fingers circular motions around your temples clockwise just putting slight pressure and once I'm done I'm just gonna go behind your ears and just slowly scratch them just slightly scratching them give you a little bit of the scalp massage and just go behind your head just just very light behind your neck and up your head just like that these types of personal attention can help relax and maybe even feel like that you're really getting a massage. I myself love the scalp massage videos. I love different types of personal attention. Sometimes um, they're harder to go to sleep to though because um, you want to concentrate on what the whisperer is trying to say. And you can use different types of objects to make a scalp 
massage sounds. I can also try. I'm doing the same motions, just small circular motions with my thumbs, but I'm using a different object to try to make a relaxation sound, hopefully triggering your ASMR, and I really just want you to relax during this session. It's also very important that you find a state of relaxation during this time. And just relax and go to sleep. To pull up a bit of your hair and just let it loose again. And this will help you relieve any stress or tension that has been building up inside your brain. The last object that I'm going to use to give you this massage. I'm just going to brush through your hair. Like this. Really just Focusing on making slow motions up your head and it's going to be very relaxing. And through these sessions, I hope you can find your true ASMR triggers. We talk about giving each other personal attention. There are many makeup videos because giving someone your makeup, getting someone's doing someone's makeup is another way of showing personal attention. Now this brush is very very soft. I'm going to show you just what I'm going to do with this brush is just take off any debris from your face. Nothing too harsh. I just I wish you can feel how soft. really is. And hopefully you'll be able to find the sound of the bristles relaxing enough to fall asleep. 
them, like I said, are brush sounds. So I have a smaller brush here and I'm going to show you how this could trigger your ASMR. This is cleaning up some of the debris on your face. At the same time, I'm giving you beautiful sounds. They will help you relax and unwind. Just cleaning off. Another very famous trigger from sounds is tapping. And I myself like tapping videos. I think just the sound of me tapping this, the, my table is very relaxing. people like harsh tapping. I prefer very soft raindrops tapping. on different surfaces can make different sounds like what I have right here. This is my glasses case. I don't really actually need glasses but um, if I'm at the back of the classroom I'll need to use them. So these are like you could call reading glasses, I guess. And they help me see the board. And I really like the sound it makes when I tap on them. I think they make the nice.
other than just hearing the tapping noises it's good to see the little nails tapping on the surfaces because it just the sensation becomes double because of the fingers there are also sounds like I like the sound of Rubik's Cube. I also like playing with my Rubik's Cube. I think the sound that it makes when it's twisting is very relaxing. Ever since I re lubricated my cube, um, I know that sounds wrong, but it's just I put oil in the Rubik's cube, and um, the stickers are beginning to fall off, and I think that really adds to the sound, which is really nice. trigger that could be um, for you. I have two more objects that um, I can show you. Um, I find a lot of instructional videos very relaxing um, or show and tell videos and I think that's why a lot of um, ASMR triggered people watch QVC or watch videos where the person is showing how to do something. Um, I'm not going to show you guys um, anything, but I'm just going to show you this little lip balm I have. And it's a gold little tub and it has skin food written on it. And it's a Korean brand. It's not a high end, it's quite drugstore, I could say. Um, but it's an avocado lip balm, but it also works as a scrub. And what you can do is I really love the sound it makes when I open it. But it looks like this. And it's really soft. And it smells really good. It doesn't really smell of avocado. It smells more like um, vanilla and soap, I guess flowers, but um, if you apply this um, before you go to bed in the morning it's your like the it should sort of exfoliate your skin or your lip um excess lip skin or dead skin and the last object that I'm going to show you today is a leather piece. Um, hopefully by now you know some of the triggers that work for you. Oh actually I have one more other than this. Um, two more, sorry. But, well, I guess the object that I'm going to show you after this is sort of related to this one, but I'm going to show you this ribbed part of 
this leather. I think a lot of people like these red sounds. This is probably not the best example, but if you put red objects ASMR in YouTube, I'm pretty sure you could find better and more ASMR tricks. is another example. The only reason I don't think it's as good as the leather purse is that because the spaces between the red um, shapes are too wide. It doesn't give us good of an effect. Paper with me. Crinkly bags and plastic bags are another type of ASMR. So I have this crinkly bag. That could help a trigger.
able to get to the relaxation and some rest and just unwind and just de-stress through ASMR videos. 